Welcome, welcome to the Rick Helps Real Estate Show. Trying to make sense of this crazy Arizona market. Big, big news today. We are shaking things up here from Rick Helps Real Estate, moving from EXP to Agave Homes and Investments LLC with one of my favorite people, Jessica. How are you? Hello. Good morning, Rick. This we get to partner up. I am very excited. Very excited. That's going to be fun. I the 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 decision behind it was <clears throat> um, to just get a more, more simple model and work closely together instead of with a large organization. And, uh, and we'll do a lot of uh, referral business together. But on top of that, um, you have access to Tucson. Absolutely. That Pinal County expansion has uh, driven me to Oracle, Arizona, Southern uh, Arizona, and now into Tucson. So it's very exciting for us here at Agave too, and glad to share that with you know your audience and all the. Well, we get a lot of subscribers that ask me questions about Tucson, and I just kind of have to throw my hands up. I go, well, I, I don't have access to that data, but now we do. So uh, it's not that I'm going to be driving to Tucson every week, but it's nice to be able to pull the numbers up and and see where we're at. But we have a website here I want to share with people if I can take a moment. And it's uh, not functioning. Well, it'll be functioning today as of this video coming up. And we've made one that's simple here because you only want to go to a website so that you can search for homes, right? And so, you know, you don't need a lot of fluff. Like Zillow has a lot of stuff, but this is faster than Zillow. This is taking you right to our MLS accounts. So, if a new listing comes on, you, you'll see it immediately. And there's a couple of ways to find them. We've broken them down by city. You can click on the drop down menu and you've got all the cities right here. And then if you scroll to the bottom of the page, you've also got them listed down here. So when you go there and we go to, we'll just say Buckeye, you're going to have access to the MLS exactly the way we do. And you can see right here, here's, here's your houses. And the right hand side you can sign up and you can have your own portal so by signing up you can say i want to know when a house for four hundred fifty thousand three bedrooms two bath of the pool in buckeye hits the market and boom you'll know immediately so um and you can tailor and filter that down as much as you want so that's the beauty about having direct mls access which is what you use too right absolutely Absolutely. So um, I had a gentleman this weekend, I was standing outside of an open house finished up. And he said, Jessica, how do I get access to what you have access to? And what a great opportunity now that this is all set up to say, I've, I got you. Pinal County, Maricopa County, here's your cities. <laughs> now Tucson. Yeah, it'll be exact same thing. So we're, we got we have two different ways to get there. One is uh, simply um, azinvest.com and the other one is rickhelps.com and they both will take you to the same website but jessica give me a little history of your background how long you've been in real estate and when did you become a broker absolutely so 20 years old um i've been an arizona native since uh well 1978 i was born and raised in northern arizona Moved down to the Valley in 99 and uh, adventured out, got my real estate license in 2003 and did uh, casual real estate for the first five years. I worked for New York Life and uh, added investments of homes to the portfolios of clients and just fell in love with real estate. So I went full-time real estate in 2006 and then in 2016 is where I made the adventure to become a broker. And uh, since 2016, Agave Homes and Investments has been home for me. So you got to ride that wild wave from 2006 to 2012. Very wild wave. I, it's funny because I remember when I first got my license thinking, what's all the hubbub about being a real estate agent? 2003, there was nothing going on. 2004, not much. And all of a sudden, the roller coaster started and looking back now, I went, wow, that was a good, it was a big ride <laughs> in the first five, six years of real estate. 
And uh, so it's so normal now. Like this is what normal real estate's about. We're in the we're in a normal market. Yeah. Now that we've hit normal, everybody's telling you it's falling apart. It's like no, no. It's actually this is this isn't bad. I looked at the numbers this morning, and new listings are 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 climbing, but new sales are following right along. Um, which, wow, that's normal. And now it's spring, so that's expected to happen. So I'm not seeing the here come all the new listings headlines that, that we've been reading about and the people have been talking about. So, but we're going to follow, we're going to continue to update people here on YouTube. In fact, going to be a little more aggressive and have a lot more um, guests on that we can interview a lot more experts. Um, so in fact, we're going to be doing one um, in March, March 26, going to be interviewing a lady named Joanna Allhands. I met her at the uh, appraisal forum. She is, she, she follows the water situation in Arizona and the legislation very closely. So I'm going to have her on and just ask her point blank. Are we running out of water? <laughs> so, so, you know, cause everybody says we're running out of water. Well, I get the impression that we're really not, but that's just me. And I want to ask her and get her on the show. And I'm looking forward to that. And Jessica, we're going to have you on quite a bit so people can, get to know you right now you live out in the east valley but you uh, zip all over the place we have a couple of referral partners that we use in the west valley it's jackie and ruby it's worked out very well for clients so we've got everything covered now so this should be a lot of fun and i can't wait and i uh i approached you with the topic of me uh coming over and joining you about a month and a half ago and after a cup of coffee we said let's do it exciting very exciting Yes. Yeah, it's going to be a fun party. Well, thanks for joining us and look forward to seeing you on here again. And we will share more details as we come up, more data, and keep everybody on top of the market. Looking forward to joining you. Talk to you Sounds soon. Good. Have a great day, Rick. Thank you. You bet.